I'm homeless, you know, I live in the street, I lose my job, but I find out with my friend, you know, the the means uh, the sister Amanda uh, his, uh, his husband Bobby with his uh, helpers uh, they come over here and, and feed us and they 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 just bought us uh, food dinner uh, Bibles for start, start uh, so so we can start the word of God. Chino is our family. Chino is, yeah, it's hot. Yes, it is hot. <laughs> Chino not only eats, but he serves. Chino you know. serves, and he ramrods, he protects, he organizes, and he keeps everybody in line, and he doesn't put up with any disrespect down here. How long have you been out here, uh, Chino? Yeah, for like 10 months, I think, 10 and months. Blessing. Um, Chino was downtown. He was homeless. He helped us out starting in November when we first months, started. Yeah, he was homeless for 10 months and he helped us for at least eight. And I bet you he was only absent probably five nights out of the whole eight months. Um, but he's going with us now to give back and to help us serve. Um, we want to let him tell you a little bit about what's going on in his life because God has just really blessed him a lot. Chino. What do you got to say, man? What has God done for you? I'm okay. That's what I have for you guys. I'm alive. Where are you working? Yeah, American, all American and custom. Okay, and you went from being homeless to getting a job, and you're the what? You're the boss, huh? No, I'm not. Really I not. mean, over your, over yeah, your. My department, yeah, I'm the boss of my department. And you've got a home? I got a house. I got a tenant house right now. And do you need? You don't need anything. You got money in your pocket. You don't need. Sheet, you Not don't that need. much, but I got something. If I want to buy something, that's all I can buy. It you now. can buy it, right? Yeah, wow. I can buy my shirt, everything. You can buy toilet paper, you can I, buy food. Actually, yeah. You see what I'm wearing? I bought it. He got off of work a little bit early, so he could go with us and help us. So he's still continuing to serve and to give back. And um, that is our goal. Our goal is to not only feed physically, but feed spiritually, and for the recipients to want to. Um, give and be appreciative. So we're excited and we're so thankful and we just look for more chinos in the future. You know this guy? Yes, this is Victor, my friend. Uh, Isn't he cute? Uh, how did y'all meet? He's got a job, met down here. Yeah, you got a job? Hey, yeah, la side, yeah, la side. Really? Oh, oh, maybe one year on the side. Yeah. One year? I'm a driver, uh, a driver, my driving. car, my car. But the lady helped me. Yeah. So, yeah, the lady helped me. Not for me, the car of my hair helped me. Where are you working? I'm driving, truck driver. Truck driver? Oh, you make big money. We, we you know, we used to just uh, go downtown to feed the homeless. Uh, right by the Toyota Center in 2004. So after that stopped, you know, I just feel that, uh, you know, uh, meeting, up with, meeting up with Trey and Amanda in 2010, you know, it was just one of those things that it was always been on uh, me and Brittany's heart to do it. So, you know, um, we've been right now, it's going on about four or five months. What's the reward for you? Heaven. <laughs> That's all I'm waiting for. Yeah, man, the, you know, uh, we waiting on for our heavenly Like my mom surgery. said, you know, serve others who serve God. You know, we, we, we waiting on for our heavenly treasures because, you know, even though if we get blessed on earth, thank God for blessings on earth, but really the church is up in heaven, which is forever, man. That's what we really focusing on. Really? That is what Vita Friend is all about. Yeah. <laughs> wow. All right, George.